Hi everyone. Brands need to be better and they need to be different or they may not be around for very long. Differentiate or die, that's what we like to say. It sounds harsh, I know, but you need to be really discerning when it comes to differentiation. How different is your brand really? Have you really found that white space or are you just a little bit same same as everyone else? Take a look at this chart called The Winning Zone. It's from a book called Beloved Brands by Graham Robinson and it's a really great tool to help you ensure that you're thinking clearly about differentiation. So start with looking at the losing zone. If you're playing in this space, it means you're going head to head with a competitor that can actually deliver to a consumer need better than you can. So you definitely don't want to be in this space. Then you've got the risky zone. So this is where you're tying with a competitor, but you can win in this space if you're either first to market or you're more innovative or you're more creative or you're building a strong emotional connection with your audience. It just takes a lot more work and a lot more investment to get there. Then you've got the dumb zone. This is where you're waging a competitive battle in a space that consumers just don't care about. And then finally, you've got the winning zone. This is where you wanna be. This is where you're offering something your consumers really want and it's something that you can do really well and it's differentiated from your competitors. It's time to make your life a little bit easier. So my question to you today is, are you playing in the winning zone? That's it from me, time for brekkie.